Hello everybody, my name is Brian Jorstad from Hilltop Camper and RV. Today I'm going to be showing you the all new 2023 Intech Terra Oasis by Intech RV. This product is going to be very different from a lot of the options out there for the travel trailer industry. It's 26 feet long, comes in right around 5,600 pounds dry weight, uh, 7,500 pounds gross vehicle weight. You'll notice it's unique tilt forward design in the front here. That allows more space, living space inside in the front rather than the cap going backwards. And then also you'll notice this giant windshield that is integrated into this gel coated front one piece cap. Uh, so the views inside are phenomenal. You've got um, one of the biggest things that's going to set them apart that uh, Intech is all about and big on is that they are welding their own chassis here is all aluminum. So uh, most of the companies out there are going to have a one piece I-beam or a welded I-beam that's steel. This is aluminum. So it allows lightweight, but it's also very strong. And then their sidewalls, unlike other brands where they're going to take a laminated wall and they're going to stack it on top of the floor and either staple or screw the floor to the sidewall. This sidewall is, it's basically all one piece unibody because the sidewall is welded aluminum and then welded to the frame. So it's basically a cage that's welded down to the aluminum chassis. So very strong. Um, as you know, when you go down the road, the challenges of the road, bumps and you know things like that, um, this is going to keep your unit lasting a long time and uh, very strong. Uh, you've got a electric awning by Gerard here on the outside that has two settings for a wind sensor on it. Uh, it is uh, got the arms that come out within the box there. So there's nothing that you have to mount back to the body of the travel trailer. Uh, this specific model we've brought in with the Rover package. So with the Rover package, you're gonna get uh, a black cover for your propane tanks that are behind that here in the front cap. You're getting a off-road tire with a two inch lift kit, as well as a rear bumper and then you've got the uh, graphics package that make it look a little bit more off-road. Um, if you come back this way, you'll see that this has the optional slide-out outside kitchen as well as the portable electric fridge. So this is a 12-volt uh, fridge that plugs in right inside here. It's on a slide-out system here. If you do not option for this, this is going to be completely passed through and we'll show you what the other side looks like. You do have storage on the other side from here, but if this is gone, it's going to be complete pass through storage. You've got your griddle cooktop here and then this tabletop just hooks right onto the outside wall. Um, let's head on inside and take a look at some of the interior features of the Terra Oasis. All right, now we're inside the Terra Oasis by Intech here. You'll see you've got plenty of seating area up in this front dinette space. Um, and a lot of that, like I was talking about outside, is because this tilt forward design. If this was tilt back, I couldn't move around and sit here. The, the wall would, you know, be intruding with my head. So you've got plenty of space around here. This will make into a bed as well to sleep two additional people. You've got tons of storage in this model. And the ceiling height is actually very high. Uh, disclaimer, I am six foot nine tall, so um, I'm going to make a lot of these trailers look a lot smaller than they are. But you notice up here, you've got really nice, no slam baggage doors, um, very nice cabinetry. You've got storage cubbies on the sides with the accent lights. You've got the MCD roller shades here. Over here in the kitchen area, you've got a farmhouse style sink that is nice and big and deep with a uh, pull out sprayer faucet here that's a high rise faucet. Uh, you've got a two burner cooktop here and with this product you've got a convection oven. 
so you can microwave or bake in this oven. Storage underneath the sink as well here and easy access to your water heater for winterization. Up on the system monitor panel here, you'll notice you have buttons for a line heater, a tank heater. So you've got uh, heated tank pads on all three of the tanks. Those are 44 gallons each. So fresh gray and black. Uh, you can turn that on in colder temps to keep that from freezing. And then on top of that, your fresh water line uh, throughout the camper has heat tape around that that you can turn that on as well. You also notice this is a gas or electric water heater, six gallons. And then of course, like most system monitor panels, it's gonna show you how full your tanks are and your battery um, as well on this panel. Right below that, we've got the Jensen stereo, which is a Bluetooth stereo uh, receiver. And there are two different zones. You've got speakers in the bedroom and up in the front area above the tilt forward windshield. Over on this side here, above the TV, you've got a battery disconnect switch, easy access to your fuses there. You've got a TV that'll angle out at a 45 degree angle for viewing. You've got nice pull out storage drawers here with no slam uh, rollers down here in your extra pantry space. You've got slide out shelving here, two shelves down there. Uh, you'll notice the air conditioner system. You've got the unit here, but there's ductwork here and then into the bedroom as well. And then over on this side here, we've got a 10 cubic foot 12 volt fridge. So it's going to cool a lot faster. Those that you want to, uh, you know, go off road um, a little bit more, you can get a, a solar and lithium battery package on this, which is going to give you 400 watts of solar panels on the roof, two lithium ion batteries that are each going to have 100 amp hours, and then you're going to get a, a 30 amp controller, that's an MPPT controller, versus the other style of controllers that are a little bit slower on charging your batteries with the solar system. Um, this is going to charge a lot faster. And then a 2000 watt inverter. So any of the outlets inside of here, you're gonna be able to use off of battery power when you're off the grid. Um, so that is an option. This model specifically doesn't have it, but it is available to order. Uh, back into the bathroom area. What we've done here is they've separated it so that you've got your shower all off to one side and uh, no curtain. The door is kind of your shower curtain and um, that's gonna keep the steam and everything separate. You know, it doesn't steam up your bathroom area. Over here, you've got a very spacious bathroom with a nice window in there, uh, plenty of room in there with a porcelain toilet with foot flush and some cabinet tree in there. So very nice bathroom set up in this model. And then we'll head into the bedroom. All right, up in the front bedroom here, you've got a large size queen bed. You've got a beautiful window for a more open feel right above the bed and two huge windows on the sides. You've got cabinetry all over the place, storage here. You've got uh, outlets, USBs and uh, 110 outlets, drawers by the sides of the bed here. Real nice, no slam drawers. Cabinetry up above. And uh, the bed, that's another, you know, one of our biggest storage spots in the bedroom is gonna be underneath here. You've got gas shocks and look at all that storage that you're getting underneath there. The cushion you see there is the cushion that uses the dinette area in the front to convert into a bed. Uh, over on this side, you'll see we have some nice storage compartments. Um, and then over on this side, We've got the TV that will come out at a 45 degree angle to lay in bed and watch TV with some more cabinets up above that. This beautiful sliding farmhouse door is going to save you a lot of space versus a swinging door. It's got a magnetic catch and then also a latch for when you're in travel. You'll notice in the living area as well, above the dinette, you've got a nice powered roof vent that is a rain sensor fan. So if it does start to rain and you're away from the camper, that's gonna sense that and automatically close so you don't get water inside. There's also going to be the same exact 
uh, roof vent fan above the bed in the bedroom as well. Over on the non-door side here, towards the rear, you've got a storage compartment. You've got space for your uh, shade, uh, protective shade that goes over the front windshield when you're traveling so that rocks don't uh, chip or break that. And then also your power cord that detaches um, to hook up to shore power. Inside of here, you've got your water hookups uh, and your fresh tank fill. And then right down below here, you've got your uh, sprayer port, which comes with the hose to uh, wash things off outside here. Use it as an outside shower if need be. Again, if this did not have the outside kitchen, pull-out kitchen option, this would be a complete pass-through storage uh, space for you, for your uh, luggage and whatever you bring camping with you on your adventures. Thank you for tuning in to check out the 2023 Intech Terra Oasis with the Rover package here at Hilltop Camper and RV. We'd love to have you out to one of our locations to see this in person. Thanks.